For some people, everyday sports just don't cut it. They would rather dive into an abyss, literally. If flirting with danger excites you, then how about visiting some of these pants-soakingly scary places for extreme activities? Amazing! You've probably been hiking and recognise that it's a pretty tame activity, but that's because you weren't hiking on a rickety system of boards suspended over 900 metres into the clouds. Mount Huashan in China's Shaanxi province features a two foot wide plank walk trail system which circles the mountain and terminates at a tea house. Hikers can grapple onto chains perilously bolted into the soft cretaceous sedimentary rock titled the Mountain of Death. It's no wonder why this is considered the most dangerous hiking trail in the world. So, either people who try this really like dangerous climbing, or they just really like tea. If that's not your cup of tea, then how about climbing the world's most active volcano? Climbers have experienced the extreme sport of volcanic mountaineering on Mount Pacaya in Guatemala. The volcanic ash cinder cones rise to over 2.4 kilometers and have erupted over 23 times since records started. So you'll want to watch your footing. And let's be honest, mountains with sheer drops and imminent danger should only be scaled by foot. Well, that apparently doesn't apply if you're a nutcase on a bike. Despite there being plenty of safe elevations to conquer, some choose the perilous cliffs of Moha in Ireland as their chosen joyride. The fearless can cycle on narrow ledges next to a sheer drop of over 180 meters to rocky tidal pools below. However, if you do fancy hurling yourself off cliffs at height, then you should try extreme kayaking. The risk of impalement, drowning or blunt force trauma clearly aren't scary enough for world record holders such as Tyler Brad. He managed to plunge over 60 meters down the Palouse Falls in one incredible feat and he isn't the only one to have kiked over waterfalls. On the other hand, climbing up a waterfall can be just as extreme. Armed with ice picks, Extreme climbers can climb up the 182 meters of frozen Rocky Mountain waterfalls in Canada. One lunatic even climbed the icy areas surrounding Niagara Falls. These icy perils are extremely dangerous because unlike alpine ice, they contain brittle, slushy and thin sections as a result of highly variable freezing patterns and thawing from the sun. Waterfalls can also break away from the walls if there isn't a solid base of frozen water. So climbers risk being taken away with falling clusters of ice. And even though rocks are less likely to collapse, climbing them can be just as dangerous. Climbers have been particularly excited by the Yosemite National Park, which contains some of the world's most famous rock formations. One of the most famous formations, the El Capitan, can be climbed many ways, including the Dawn Wall and Prophet Route, which are apparently some of the most difficult climbs in the world. Nearly perfectly smooth, only world-class climbers will be able to climb it. And its sheer line exceeds 900 meters. Alternatively, some people prefer to descend into the earth rather than climb away from it. Caving can be just as extreme due to complex labyrinth-like caverns which can disorientate and trap thrill seekers who may even fall to their death. One especially insane cave is the giant crystal cave in Mexico. Sitting on fault lines, it is super hot and cavers would only survive about 10 minutes in it unprotected, even with their special refrigeration suits. Scientists can only last approximately 30 minutes. Along with the fact that caving here is restricted, it's pretty hard to explore this cave. But you can explore the world's deepest cave, the Krubera Cave, which is just as amazing as it is dangerous. And if you're claustrophobic, then you should probably stay away from tight passage caves, such as Airmen's Cave in Texas. Because let's be honest, it's so exciting being trapped hundreds of meters below the ground. Or how about going one step further by going underwater, cave diving through tight gaps in pitch black caves and tunnels hundreds of meters below the surface is extremely dangerous and underwater relics of the dead and warning signs confirm this. One of the most dangerous underwater caves is the Blue Hole Cave in Egypt, which is apparently 130 meters deep. The draw of this treacherous cave site is reaching the arch, which divers can swim through to open water. But because of its depth at 56 meters, many divers get confused and swim further beyond safe limits. An estimated 150 people have died while diving here in the last 10 years. Even so, 
You don't have to be below the water to be in danger. Bizarrely, some people have adapted the rather mundane sport of paddleboarding into an extremely terrifying activity. How, you may ask? Well, mix in a circling great white shark and you can assume the role of a sitting duck. Maybe Jackass will try this one off the South African Cape. Thanks for watching and subscribe to be amazed. Also, don't forget to check out the amazing video by clicking the box on the screen now.